What is up, Clasher? This easy. Bring you a real short video today. We are about to go into another event. It is going to be the Go Wipe event. Go Wipe Golem Wizard Pekka. <laughs> Any way you wrap that up is it's not right, but that's the name of it. <laughs> so, got a couple of short little uh, attacks. One of them's not even a Go Wipe. Matter of fact, three of them. On this video is not a go wipe, but we got a go wipe <laughs> on this video. The first one is actually Town Hall 11 from Flex Luger. It's a it's a variation of the go wipe. It's a Jaya wipe, which is Giants instead of Pekka. And in Town Hall 11, with the Eagle Artillery and with the Infernal Towers, the Golems can get beat up pretty bad. So instead of the Golems, you'll put in a couple of you you'll put in six Giants per Golem. So the collective hit points for the Giants are actually higher than the Golem and if they stay together and they're getting hit by single target defenses they will last longer than a Golem. So there's a lot of benefits from it and here, here if you see where that bottom Infernal Tower is in single target mode and it, it only could handle one gol one Giant before the, all the Giants killed it. If it locked onto a golem because it doesn't do much damage per second, it would have cut the golem in half and then killed all parts of it before it could t before it could take it out. So the giants were a huge advantage in that attack. So town hall ten, town hall eleven, adapt a little bit because you're, you're in a higher town hall and because the defenses are different. Take out those golems and add the giants instead, and then go wipe is actually a viable attack even all the way up in town hall eleven. Whereas go wipe is a heavy hitting attack in town hall eight. Once you get into Town Hall 9, most clans won't let you use it in war because it's not really a 3 star attack. They have the Golem which is slow moving, Peck is slow moving. The Wizards are great but they're real flimsy so you get you run into one set of Giant Bombs, all the Wizards are gone and you're left with Golems that just chop at walls, uh, rumor has it. And then Pekka doing most of the damage. Also notice that he started with a Queen Walk before anything so he put the queen with healers on her the warden behind her and they're still up and that's really one of the main elements in this attack that makes it go so far you take that out and this is not a three star attack uh, the, the queen walk is actually part of many many different strategies to make them three star attacks okay this next attack is by Dave it is actually the official go wipe this is an attack that everyone hears about in Town Hall 7, Town Hall 8, and then you'll hear about how you're never supposed to use it again once you get to Town Hall 9. Reason is, and we'll go through the history of it a little bit, uh, it has Golem. They tank for the Wizards, they tank for the they tank for the P.E.K.K.A as well. Let's back up. The Golem and P.E.K.K.A both tank for the Wizards, how's that? Because P.E.K.K.A is such a powerful troop. Uh, the problem is, that it works well in Town Hall 8. Town Hall 8 is a fairly small overall Town Hall. But once you get to Town Hall 9, it's much bigger. It has the crossbows. And the, there's more traps that seem to take hold, uh, take out those wizards. So you're usually left with Gollum and Pekka. And you just can't get through Town Hall 9 like you can Town Hall 8. So a lot of people love it in Town Hall 8. Because they have level 3 Pekka. Which, by the way, stays level 3 into Town Hall 9. They don't go up again until Town Hall 10. So you're having the same level of P.E.K.K.A as you do in Town Hall 8. And it's just not a good idea to, to keep using this attack past Town Hall 8. Now there are variations, as you saw earlier. Uh, adding the Giants instead of the, instead of the Golem. That's a good adaptation for Town Hall 9, 10, and 11. And even then, it's, uh, it's, a hard, it's hard for me to say use this in war. And in farming, I mean, Peck is a very expensive troop, so it has its place in Town Hall Eight. It helps you. It helps you get used to using big troops. Uh, it's a, one of those uh, steps you take as you're graduating from Town Hall Eight to Town Hall Nine. 
and and maybe um, there'll be a good way for us to use them in Town Hall 9. I know that people use healers on the on the P.E.K.K.A. and they can they can push them even further. Uh, but as it is now, I'm still saying uh, Go Wipe is going to have to be stay in the in the Town Hall 8 toolkit and leave it leave it behind in Town Hall 9. Okay, we have some a, a, bon a couple bonus attacks. This is Ezekiel builder base attack. I called this the Braganon attack. I don't know what that name of it really is, but it's baby dragons, which are called Brags, in the cannon cart. So Braganon. What is Braganon? And what I use in this attack, this is this has not got me as far as I would have liked. I and the reason I say this is because I've kind of been spinning my wheels right at 2,800 trophies, and I don't I don't use the builder base as much as, as a lot of people do I haven't pushed forward on the builder base but this ha this is an effective attack I just can't get it to work all the time because I'm not good enough with it yet <laughs> so what you'll do is you put the hero in first and he tanks with the cannon carts the cannon cart and the hero is mainly put in to take out a, a few key air defenses like the air bombs once the air bombs are gone then you can use the baby dragons to take out the rest of the base uh, and if used right, I when when I three star with this attack, I can three star and I'll have ma many many baby dragons left over. Uh, but the problem is, if the base is built right, it's very hard to three star with them. Now I know other players in our clan have easily got to three thousand trophies using a very similar army. Myself, I'm I'm kind of going back and forth. Wanted to show this though because it is a good army. It it is a good uh, attack. And you can see that was that, that was a pretty decent base, a common base, and it was a, a real easy to three star. Now the problem is, is that on the other side, that it seems like every time I have a base that's fairly easy to three star, the other guy comes right back at me and smashes me and three stars me right back. Uh, he used giants, cannon cart, and I believe barbarians in his attack, and for once he didn't just come and get it right back. Seems like uh, every time I three star, and it's a real good attack, they'll come right and three star me right back. And I think that's one of the reasons why I can't move ahead in the builder base because when I'm overpowered, outmatched, I can't do much against them. And then they just come and beat the crap out of me. So they get the, they get three stars. I get one. I go back one step, two step, three steps. Then I get a base that's even with me. I three star. They tie me. <laughs> the hell's up for that? Anyway. Uh, if you notice too, I didn't build a big square. I'm not a real big fan of the big square, and I know that those uh, those types of bases actually defend really well. But I want to try to be a little creative, and I just I just moved this base around a little bit, giving a little sneak peek of the base. Uh, if you end up playing against me after you're watching this video, then uh, that you put a lottery tonight because you're this lucky man or woman. <laughs> um, put both crushes right next to each other uh, because the last attack they came in that wall down below and I forgot that you can come in any of the four sides so didn't really think ahead there good job easy still got, got uh, when they come in that right side they have to go through both crushes that usually does take out the hero so then they can't really last for, for the entire attack they end up having four defenses left and two of them are double cannons so double cannons versus ground defenses they do really well so a uh, pretty good base I'm, I'm happy with it so short video Wanted to show this. We're gonna actually put this on to our website underneath the, the Go Wipe page. We have a page on the website www.clashmadeeasy.com, and it has a bunch of different types of attacks on it. So go check it out. It is uh, it's on the Attacks 101 page on, in the in the website www.clashmadeeasy.com. Go check it out. Appreciate you guys for watching. Uh, Go to the channel if you're not on the channel and you're in the website. Go to the channel. It's Easy Street Gaming. Uh, we have 185 videos as of today. 185. I can't believe how many videos we have. <laughs> and uh, we're just making more because I just love it. If I could work like this, then I'd be a millionaire, but I can't. I have to make videos instead. <laughs> Till next time. It's been easy. Take care, everybody.